Again, we just heard the vocal technique of the group, A Darker Shade. There are special guests here on Channel 13. And real quick, why don't you introduce yourselves real quick. My name is Dizzo. My name is Darb. My name is Trace. Yeah, all from the Big Oak Town, right? Yeah. As a matter of fact, um, your music, which is very smooth. I mean, your dance steps, they're out there. I mean, 
there's a lot of different groups like say the temptations or a lot of like four tops i mean does your music do you inf does that influence you that type of music to present some of the music that you present now yeah it does uh we got our inspiration from groups uh, like those, and uh, we feel that it helps It helps the music to see a visual, you know. Yeah. As a matter of fact, you look like you guys did a little planning here. I mean, the same suits, I mean, down ties, the shoes. The shoes are, t the shoes are tough. You know, that's what I'm telling you. I mean, is it real important to present, like, say, the visual as well as the audio to present, uh, like, say, a fuller act and put, present more that way? Do you want to answer that? Yeah, um, both the music and the visual should be uh, basically the same level because both of them help you, you know, without, without either two, you know, you kind of come up short. Yeah, coming up short. Remember, don't come up short. That's the key word. As a matter of fact, the song, which was tight, is that original music that you guys put together? Or? Yeah, all our stuff is original. We put that together a long time ago. Tracy wrote it. He was 16. 16 years old. and uh, 16? Yeah, we did it for you today. Hope they like it. So how, how old are you now, Trace? 28. 28. 12 years ago, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. I mean, is it pretty easy for you to come up with lyrics and come up with songs? Because I understand you also make the beats too, right? Yeah. Well, basically, when I, hear, when I do a song, I hear the music already done. And I just go and play it. You know, the lyrics, well, sometimes we have, the lyrics don't always come. And we kind of collaborate on lyrics, but the music just is done. When I hear it. Yeah. And a matter of fact, there's like a lot of different groups coming out now. Boys the Man, Joe to See, Tony, you know, Tony, Tony, Tony. What sets you apart, like, say, uh, different from them groups as opposed to, like, the same? Well, we concentrate on our vocals and our steps. You know, like the Temptations, basically, uh, when uh, Tony's, they, uh, they play and they do steps and different things, but we concentrate on our vocals and our, and our steps. And getting the, you know, our feelings across to the audience on the song. Yeah. And you guys primarily are like background vocals, or do you do any leads at all? Okay, y'all do lead. As a matter of fact, you you did the last song, right? I mean, why don't you tell me a little about a bit about your influences and how you present, you know, in your music yourself? Uh, actually, I'm influenced by a lot of different singers. Uh, one of my favorite singers happens to be Gerald Levert, but I don't I don't try to copy any any particular singer I just I have my own style and I try to I, I'm influenced by so many different people that you know it's just I put it all together and I get a certain style and that's what I try to stick to yeah and you guys are all from Oakland why don't you quickly tell me like for all the people in Oaktown that do watch the show and can relate to these brothers where are you from exactly I'm from Hercules Hercules oh so you're a little bit outside of uh... outside but I come out to Oakland every day I've been out here since I was born. All my friends live out here, so. You know East Mama? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Rasa in the house. Why don't you tell me where you're from exactly? I live on uh, 28th and Adeline. Adeline, yeah. What's up? The same. Same thing? Okay. West Oakland. West Oakland. Are you guys related at all? or? Brothers. Oh, you're brothers. Is that right? No twins? or? No, we're not twins. Who's older? You? He's the oldest. <laughs> Is that right? Okay. Yeah, as, as a matter of fact, you guys have an EP out now, right? Is that available now? Yes, it's in the stores. Uh, it's been in the stores since July 1st. Hopefully with the support of the community, we'll be able to do pretty good with that. And do you guys see a forthcoming album coming out? Yeah, yeah, it'll be coming up yeah, at the end of the year. Works. Yeah. As far as like your music, I mean, is there like a message that you maybe want to present in your music or is it just strictly having fun or what's happening? Well, basically our, our music projects um, a lot of a lot of issues like family, which has to do with you know everybody, and um, we try to bring these issues out front so everybody's able to deal with them. Along like with our colors, if you notice, we have uh, red and green and yellow. Each color stands for a different different meaning, and basically our whole concept is a darker shade is things from a minority's point of view. So my my color stands for peace, and my color stands for harmony, and I, mine stands for unity. Yeah, which is very important. And um, one thing I want to ask too, I mean, in Oakland, say for instance, we got a skyrocketing homicide rate, which is going already to 120, and it seems like it ain't going any lower, it's going to stop. I mean, in your music, do you think maybe that you having positive lyrics or presenting your music in a certain way, kids will be listening to the lyrics, or do you think your music can change or make maybe possibly help make a change? Oh, I think I think it can make a change because, like, for instance, the song we have called "Family," um, 
breaks it down to a lot of our problems start from the center of the family, you know, from the kids who are from single parent homes and, and don't have the, the influence from a mother and father. You know, they turn into the streets and everything has a reason. You know, we look at our problems, we have the homicide and everything. It's just, it's not because uh, everybody in Oakland is bad. You know, no, where, wherever you are on the earth, if you don't stick to the family foundation, you're going to suffer somewhere. So we need to just tighten up and, and face the issues that, you know, that we have in our community. Yeah, which is very important. Did you want to comment on that? Yeah, I would like to say we like to do a cappella. Yeah, as a matter of fact, I was going to mention that. But just to let you know, you kids know out there, that is true. A, f a good family unit as well as education and self-esteem, and it will take you as far as you want to go. So if you want to kick that funky a cappella, the mic is yours. Lift and Voice and sing Till earth and heaven ring Ring with the harmony Of liberty Let our rejoicing High as the glistening sky Let it resound Loud as the rolling sea The sea Sing a song Full of the faith that the dark past has taught us Facing the rising sun of the new day begun, let us march on till victory is won, is won, is won. Yeah, yeah. Tell me these boys ain't got no talent. I think it speaks for itself. Hey, I want to thank you guys for coming down and spending time with us. It seems like you got your thing down, so you definitely have a game plan, so I know I'll be seeing you in the future. Thanks for coming down. Yeah, just to let you know, you heard it here first, a darker shade. Yo, peace.